Hey what's up everyone, it's your friend 23 here and welcome back to a new episode of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. And last episode we reached Sora's domain and also finished this little shrine here. But today the plan is to continue on this uh, regional phenomena quest and uh, help the people of Sora's domain with, I guess, removing this sludge that has fallen into the water. Or at least investigate why that is. Uh, and I also want to flag quickly here that I'm starting to feel a bit under the weather, so I might not be the most energized this episode, but I will try my best to comment as good as possible. Let's start talking with this girl right here, or boy. Um... Maybe it's a girl. I'm not sure. <laughs> Doesn't really matter. Troma. Oh, I'm so sorry. Everyone has been treated now. But we have used up all the splash fruits. <sighs> there were more injuries than anticipated. Please accept my apology. Uh? You have nothing to apologize for. You did what you had to be... You did what had to be done. Most importantly, I am grateful that everyone is alright. Now, if we could only do something about that statue. Mm -hmm. Hmm. You there. Are you a traveler? I am sorry that I did not notice you until now. I was focused on a matter of a great importance. Sora's domain is in troubled, time, in troubled times at present due to the sludge falling from the sky. Uh, thing have... Things have finally calmed down, at least for the moment. However, this place remains covered in sludge. Such a shame, as this particular statue is so incredibly important to the Sora of the Domain. Hmm. We were just discussing how we need to wash away the sludge. I apologize that I cannot provide a great deal of hospitality. Please do make yourself at home here. Nice, so now we have started the... Um, this quest line. I guess we just need to throw a uh, Chucho Jelly here so she will <laughs> know that we are of help. Can we also throw a uh, fruit in here? No. Can we talk to her again now? Yeah. Whoa. The sludge. I see you managed to wash it away. The statue is a symbol of hope for the Sora. It is very precious to us. Thank you so much for cleaning yes. it up. In truth, the statue, despite the majestic forms of, of the pair who saved the cherished domain in the past. <coughs> that's right. Beloved Prince Sidon of the Sora and his best friend Sir Link, the heroic Highland Swordsman. <coughs> that's us. It is simply wonderful, is it not? How I would love to meet him someday. Say, have you have a... Say, you have a similar stature to the Hylian hero. Similar eyes as well. Oh my, and you're also a Hylian? And a swordsman? Wait, could it be? Could be. Are you Link? The swordsman of legend? <clears throat> Please remember to mind your manners, Chroma. Um, oh, um, please accept my apology. Yes, Yes, please pardon our rudeness. Whoa. I'm quite surprised to learn that you are the legendary swordsman, Sir Link. I have heard mentions of you nearly every day since I first arrived at this domain. I am Prince Sidon's... Oh, forgive me. I am your best friend's fiancé. <laughs> my name is Yona. <laughs> I am truly honored to have the opportunity to meet you, Sir Link. Yona, the caretaker of Sora. I had heard that you were missing along with Princess Zelda. If I may ask, what brings you here? To think that such a thing took place beneath Hyrule Castle, and now you are traveling the kingdom to investigate? So your search for Princess Zelda is what brought you to this domain? Sure. In that case, feel free to investigate the area around the domain as throughout as you see fit. Oh, I have a lovely idea. 
if you don't mind, I ask that you please go and meet with Sidon. I am certain that he will, would be delighted to see you. Sidon can be found at Mipha Court, located at the peak of Loimus Mountain. Yes, we're climbing the mountain again. <laughs> Lady Yona, it is time. I fear we must be going now. Forgive me, Sir Link, but I must be on my way. Ah, but if it pleases you, after you have met with Sidon, perhaps you could visit me at the infirmary on the floor above. I am determined to be of assistance to you as best as I can, Sir Link. The sludge cupboard statue. Complete. That was a quick little quest. So now we have a new objective, uh, which wants us to go up to the mountain, and we will do it soon. First we will just buy some arrow, I guess. Oh. Always nice. Mm. Island Rise, Swift Violets. Uh, this, these are nice, because you can buy them and oh. cook them into increased movement speed, so I'm gonna take them as well. <laughs> And then was is this tomatoes? Yeah. Did we just talk to yeah. this dude as well? Welcome. Did you need me for something? Tell me about Aww. this place. Our seafood is so fresh. It's fishing. That's the new motto for our general store, the Colder Reef. Aww. Ah, but I'm not sure when we'll be able to restock the fish. Uh, I apologize for the inconvenience. You need anything else? How's it going? Aww. Well. To be fair, I'm quite lucky to have my health, considering all of the sludge nonsense. And yet, we have already used up all of our splash fruit that I gathered. Ah. My offerings are far from ideal, but for the time being... Uh, my offerings are far from ideal for the time being, but I'm doing my best to keep my spirits high. Do you need anything else? I want to oh. sell. I'm not sure if I want to sell. Do I have anything of value to sell even? have some opals. We can sell those. Oh. And that's about it, I guess. <laughs> we have a lot of luminous stones also, so why not sell like... 10 of them. 11. Why not? Oh. So now we have some cash again. Oh. What's over here? Mm. This document appears to be... Relatively recent. I must examine older text if I if I hope to find information on the Skyland that Prince Sidon is looking for. Yeah. Link, have you already spoken with Lady Yona? He is attempting to repair your Sora armor. <sighs> you know full well when the Sora armor allows even a Highland like you to climb waterfall. It is essential if you hope to travel these parts with ease. Lady Yona is at the infirmary. I suggest you confer with her there at once. Where is the infirmary? I thought I could jump over there, but I could not. Like, do I take damage from the sludge or can I just bathe in it? it looks like I can bathe in it. We snapped a picture on these before. No, don't you turn your back on me, dude. I want to snap a nice little picture on you. Here we are. That's great. Nice. Then you're mine as well. Let's talk over here as well. It's Linny. Oh, um, I mean, hello, Link. I'm impressed you were able to make it to the domain. The roads are muddied up with the sludge, and the river is so dirty we can't even swim in it. You really are amazing, Lin. Oh, Link. You. Mm. Ah, enough already. I can't stand it. It feels so cold and unnatural to call you that, as though we were strangers. 
I thought it would feel weirder to call the hero of the domain by some silly nickname I gave him as a child, but... Oh, oh whatever. I'm just going to go ahead and call you Linny. Hey, Linny. Ah, yes. That feels so much better. I call you Linny because you're more than just linked to me. I hope you'll forgive me for using my old friend card for that. Anyway, you're amazing, Linny. Only you could make it to the domain under these conditions. I'm so happy to meet you again. Oh, oh I know. You should stay here. You will, won't you? As you can see, you're our only customer, so you, you got the whole place to yourself. Try the waterbed if you like. It's divine. Is this the waterbeds? Link, welcome. We have lost many customers because of the sludge. It does not bode well for us. And we're unsure where Sasan has gone off to. My daughter is quite attached to him, so we're all worried. He might be covered in sludge sludge at the moment. I certainly hope that this is not the case. Ah, oops. I really must return oh. to my work. Thank you oh. for coming by. Enjoy a sleep as deep as the ocean here at Seabed Inn. Will you be staying? Our regular beds are 20. Our blissful water beds is 50. I will take a blissful water bed. And we can sleep until noon. Oh. Sounds like a bouncy bed. Not sure if that was a restful night of sleep. Looks like it was. Ah, so you're awake, Link. I hope you enjoyed the blissful water bed. Mm, looks like I did. And also, we bought those flowers, so why not? Uh, vital rich flower blooms mainland when cooked into a dish. Okay, so we don't need four of them. So let's try to make some, some little dish here. If you remember correctly, a pumpkin and a meat, and then just throw one of these in. That should give us extra movement speed. Did not. When cooked into a dish, the nursing compound increases your move speed. Why didn't you work? <laughs> okay, let's try three of them then. And one of these. Is this the need? Okay, good enough. So let's go and try to find Sona again. Or was that her name? Uh, the, the, the Sora Domain's leader's wife. Is that dude? Yeah, Prince Sidon's wife, because she was working on our armor. So let's see if she's up here. Oh, this is just kids. Uh, my brother's super into pretending he's King Dorifan. He'd better not get carried away and say stuff he's not supposed to do. <laughs> my impression of King Dorifan is really good, isn't it? He's not in the domain right now, but... Hey, never mind. I'm not gonna say. It's a big secret. Okay. Dumbo, you're amazing. You sound just like King Dorofan. Hee hee. <laughs> Wait. Was the one ha huh, too many? Ah, this is hard. I wonder what the secrets are, though. Ah, greetings. Did you come to see Prince Sidon? If you're looking for Prince Sidon, he can be found at Mifa Court. I guess it's up there. And that place can be found at Polymus Mountain. It has such an exquisite exquisite view. I've considered not telling others about it. Although, I suppose I just did. Mm. Oh. Ah, is she over here? Yeah, here. Just one more thing. If this sludge really is quite stubborn. I dearly hope our patience, patience recovers soon. Ah. Lady Yona, Sir Link is here at last. Oh, Oh, you really came. How for fortunate. I was hoping to speak with you about an item you entrusted the domain with repairing. Your sword armor. Ah. The repair is mostly complete, but it does require just one more thing. I need an ancient arowana. 
I can fish. Finish the armor right away if I can somehow acquire a scale from that fish. We have not seen ancient arowanas lately, but I have no idea where they can be found. Hmm. Since they are used for making armor, then to the blacksmith may know something about how to get one. If you find one, can you please bring it to me? Do that, and I shall fix your precious item at once and return it to your care. <laughs> As you well know, the Sora armor allows even a highland like you to climb waterfalls with ease. I am certain it will provide useful to you. Please do not forget my request. I have seen those arowanas before. I thought I had one, but maybe I have used up used it already in some food cooking. I don't know. You wanted me to talk to the blacksmith. Where is the blacksmith in this town? Are you the blacksmith? I'm feeling much better than before. It's all thanks to Lady Yona. Yes, not. Uh, ah. If only that sludge would stop falling. I feel you. I have no clue where the blacksmith are. Oh, yeah. Isn't it the dude up that I talked up? Not here. Uh, next to the store. So down here. I think that's the must be the blacksmith. So it's you. So it's you. Do you need something? I see you seek an ancient arowana. In that case, I have heard whispers that the what you seek have been spotted near Mifa's statue, which is at the peak of Olimus Mountain. This rare fish that has almost never been caught and was used in the distant past to repair the sore armor. Why has it appeared again? Is this too a result of the upheaval? Okay, so I guess we're going up. Because that's the Polymus Mountain. Did he say Mi Didn't he say Mika's later? Mifa's statue. Okay, not the lake. So probably some type of statue up here. So let's get ascending then. And where should be a good place to go? Yes, take this bridge over here. <laughs> I'm going the wrong way. something that I need to photograph. Waterfall. See, did we ascend through the mountains there? I think that's the easiest way to climb up. Also, I wanna check if it's some type of secret behind the waterfall. Sometimes it are. Yep, something. Discovery. Pristine Sanctums. Lanyo Great Springs. Can we use it? Here? Yeah, this is probably a better way to ascend, actually. What 
What is this? Ah, who approaches? Is that you? So it is. Link. How did you find this place? What cruel ploy are you plotting? Oh, my ever loyal Muzu. If you speak in such a way without explanation, Link here will only be confused as what is going on. Ah, there is the King of Sora. He looks a bit sick. Hello, Link. It has been some time since we last spoke. I had received word that you went missing along with Princess Zelda. Why have you come here? Well, well. To think that such a thing should transpire for a hero of Hyrule and Princess Zelda. Huh? You accept us to believe that Princess Zelda simply disappeared? Just like that? Do not sully our ears with your lie. This dude doesn't like me. <laughs> I saw Princess Zelda with my own eyes right after the phen phenomenon at Hyrule Castle took place. Hmm. Calm yourself, Muso. Link's eye betray no hint of deception. He remains as a trusted friend of the Sora. There must be an explanation. Link, I will now tell you what happened when we last saw Princess Zelda. As well as the reason behind my seclusion here in Pristine Sanctum. Oh. We encountered Princess Zelda just after Hyrule Castle ascended into the sky. Floating island appeared as if from nowhere. Sludge and fragments of ruins began raining down. Musu and I had left the domain to investigate this strange occurrence. That is, that is when it happened. Princess Zelda descended from the sky, accompanied by a sludge monster. What happened next took us by surprise. She then unleashed the beast upon us. King Derufan valiantly vanquished the threat. However, he was gravely injured by the sludge during the battle. As for Princess Zelda, she vanished without a trace. If word got out that Princess Zelda lost her mind and harmed the Sora King, the result, the resulting turmoil would be devastating. That is why we are temporarily remaining hidden within the pristine sanctum. According to your story, Princess Zelda disappeared suddenly in the depths beneath Hyrule Castle. On the other hand, she suddenly appeared near Sora's domain and unleashed a monster upon us. The water of truth have become murkier still. But from the Sora perspective, one, th one thing is clear. It all slid back to the sky. This disaster, the sludge, the monster, and even Princess Zelda. It may, be, it may well be that the answers to these riddles can only be found skyward. Sidon ordered Jihato, a historian well equated with ruins to investigate. I wonder if any progress have been made. Does that mean I need to go back to the guy studying those transcripts? Let's just quickly go and watch if he gives us anything else. There we go. It's the place we're going after, but first, quickly... Probably faster to, <laughs> to just quick travel. Let me open the correct setting there. Okay, quickly ascend here. see what this person says now. Mm -hmm. This document appeared to be recently appeared. I must examine. Okay. That was nothing. That was quite a waste. Going back. Ah, 
I need to read this again. That's the arowana. Side on it. Okay, I guess that's the next thing to do then. I'm a bit waste traveling back. Maybe you can ascend on these ones. It looks like a bridge up also. Reservoir Lake. I don't know where we're going this way. Oh my god, here we have one of these guys. Of my favorite enemy type. Nice little headshot. Oh my god. They're always so slippery. Headshot? That's not a headshot, huh? Uh, uh, do we have anything nice? Yes. This will manage. And a quick ah, almost. Coming up here. Yeah. Oh. Let's let him walk a bit. Boom. And headshot. We'll take his staff. We did it <laughs> all all the way down. I will not take his staff. Here we need a mountain that's a bit closer to the ground. I guess this one, if we just burn these sharp things up. Are we even getting upstream? Oh. <laughs> We got one, but I was not good enough to reach it. And um, here is a cave. What is this nice place? I would probably climb this way instead. But it's wet mountains and I hate climbing those. Mm, I guess we do it. We have the potion with grip precision resistant. Maybe we should use it here actually. one and we can I thought we could climb without falling down it looks like you can't jump uh, even with that resistant on
Yep. Jump up now. Get that lizard, sticky lizard, always nice. chest nice the climbers spun down and it was really worth going here and also some nice loot even more Diamond, nice. That's the first for the game. And here I should be able to just ascend up, I guess. This will save us time on climbing. That's really nice, actually. Let's quickly unlock this shrine. Ah, oh, wrong fruit. Good that we have uh, collected quite a lot of those water sludge. Midrad perch. Mid air perch. Maybe midrad. These I know what they do already. You hit them to activate them and then they are like floating in the air. We found one of these platforms in the depths when we were fighting that uh, Giga boss. That should be enough. Maybe one was it? No, we needed both. Yeah. Oh, first activate it. Okay, I see what they want me to do. Put this in the middle. Roughly right there. Like this. Rotate. <laughs> Maybe not like that though. Oh! It fell down. Let's try this again. It was a bit high up uh, last time. We wanna lower it and then forward. Yes, around that should be good. Should also attach it to make it secure. Oh, it's almost a bit far away. Ah, we need it again, huh? Yes, we just attach it to the middle. Good enough. Will it float now, still? Yeah. So I guess something like that. Nice, nice, nice. The ball should go over there. That looks like... So okay, I understand. Before we do that, it's probably gonna be a chest up here. Maybe. 
It were not. Ah, there is the chest. Yeah, we only really need two. Because you can like make a staircase. Flipping. Like one, then you jump here. Then you take the other one. And you just increase it slightly. Is that enough? Yeah. Thank you. Here we can just try if this is enough force. So take this. Just a bit higher. And then ball. Attach ball here. And then I guess just hit it. Maybe I should have climbed up first. Oh. Or even just do this. <laughs> I should have gone with that thing. Okay. Just did have to do one extra step. Huh? And boom. We have five of those. We need to pray next time we see a statue. Yes, this is our good friend, the prince. He got happy. Link, it has been far too long. I received word that you have gone missing and was beside myself with concern. Whatever could have transpired. No! You think something like that could have taken place beneath Hyrule Castle? And afterward, you mysteriously awoke on a sky island? The sky. Could it be that the sky is the key to everything after all? Hmm. Ah, my apologies. I have actually been wondering if th those floating sky islands could have been the source of the falling sludge. That is why I have tasked a Sora historian with investigating rune fragments and all historical documents related to the sky. As for me, I am not at liberty to leave this spot at present, as I am uniquely qualified to deal with sludge here. Hmm. Then let's help you clean it up, I guess. You see, old friend, this place is the source of water that flows into the Sora's domain. That is why I must use my power of water manipula manipulation to separate the sludge from our water in order to clean it. If I cease, then the solid water will flow into our beloved home and there will be much pain and suffering. That is why I cannot afford to live here, no matter what. Hmm. Say, Link. Does it not seem that Princess Zelda's whereabouts might be related to the floating sky islands and the ruins? If so, perhaps you should go and speak with our historian Yihato. His many years have blessed him with great wisdom. It is quite possible that he could provide you with some useful information. At present, you should be able to find Yihato continuing his investigation at Toto Lake. By the way, I hope you know that I'm truly happy to see you again after such a long time apart, my dearest friend. Visit me anytime you like. Your presence is never anything less than welcoming and appreciated. What happens if I throw a water thingy on this sludge, big sludge mountain here? Probably nothing, but let's try it either way. 
Did it actually shrink a bit? No, no, no. Okay, that's that's an impossible task. So he told me to go somewhere else now, right? Speak to Yehato at Toto Lake. Uh, may yield information. Okay. What was Toto Lake? doesn't say. Can I ask him where it is? Hey. Link, my dearest friend, is there anything you would like to inquire about? Ask me whatever your heart desires and I shall do all I can to help. Yehato? I have tasked a historian Yehato with investigation the ruin fragments and any history, history books regarding the sky. If you believe that Princess Zelda whereabouts are related to floating islands or, or the ruins, speak with him. I believe Yehato is currently conducting his investigation at Toto Lake, which, which is northwest of here. Nice. Is there something else you wanna ask about? The sludge. This is truly a burden. I'm using my ability to manip- And this is- we heard. Yes. Yes. Yona? Lady Yona? She is my dearest childhood companion, and much more. She is also my fiancé, my intended, my bride-to-be. There was a time when we saw each other often. But life got in the way, as it does. Time has certainly gotten away from us. I recall our childhood days with utmost fondness. And at last, she has come to visit for the first time in a while. And yet... I must admit I have been a tad awkward around her. Due to the situation at hand, we have barely spoken since she arrived. She has been an immense help in easing our struggles here. I am so grateful for her kindness. Link, it's a brutal being... It's, it is brutal being unable to help you with your investigation. Still, please do let me know if you make any head. So, northwest from here. Uh, maybe it's this lake or something. I do, here it is, I'm blind, total lake. And also, we didn't... Restoring the Sora armor. The dude told me about some kind of fish, and that fish would be... ...at Mifa Lake. Guess there's no fishes here, right? This is more of a pond than a lake, also. Let's just quickly run up here. Uh, he said that the Mifa statue, so maybe the statue is up here. Yeah, I think it is. What is that from? Ah, oh, too late. Yeah, here they are, the fishes. Nice. talk to this dude as well. Uh -huh. Wow, I was wondering who that might be. And it turns out to be none other than Link. Look, do you see how much Polymus Mountain has changed? It now enshrines the glorious statue of Mipha. She looks after the Sora from here, just like she always did. The reason we can endure this sludge is because everyone's effort and also thanks to her kind protection. By the way, there are some fish I've never seen before swimming at the base of this statue. Just now, I could have sworn I heard something plop into the water. Whatever it was, I wonder if, if it was hoping to, get, hoping to get closer to Mifa. I think it was me jumping into the water, dude. And I needed a fish. That's why I jumped in. Okay, so we need to go to this thing, which is still up in the lakes, and then we want to go back. So I wonder if we're gonna go back first and get that armor, and then we can just quick travel up again.
<laughs> you got scared? Would have also been scared. If someone just came up from the ground just behind me. So she was up here if I'm corrected, yeah. Got your ancient arowana. It looks like Tona is on demand. I'm so happy, what a relief. <laughs> Not even the sludge has the power to break up Prince Sidon's fan club. Good morning, Sir Link. Have you located an ancient arowana by any chance? If only I had that fish scale, I could fix your precious Sora armor. Here you go. Wow. Ah, an ancient arowana. With this, I can finally finish repairing your treasured Sora armor. Please wait just a short moment while I hurry in the workshop. Nice. Mm. I'm so honored to reunite with... I am so honored to reunite you with this item, dear Link. Thank you, thank you. Yes, yes. Your armor is as good as new. Nice. Please take this along with our well wishes. I'm so happy that I was able to return to its pristine state. It's a precious piece of armor, after all. As you well know, this, as you well know. The Sora armor allows even a highland like you to climb waterfalls with ease. Oh, so now we can get up to the sky. Of course, it will not help you with the climbing waters that have been tainted with sludge. So I guess we need to clean those first. However, your great skill, Sir Link, I am certain will find a way up for the waterfall, clouded though it is. Wow. Please use this well for your Investigation into Princess Zelda whereabouts. Thank you. Is there anything else? No. Yes. Not right now. So let's quick travel back up. some splashes. God, you're so slow in this lunch. I guess it's this person we're gonna talk to. Dude. Ah. Sai, I will never understand the ways of historians. Can you not conduct the investigation more cautiously? Yeah. Oh, oh there, I certainly hope that you did not overhear me. I'm grumbling to myself like that. It's not as it sounds, really. Ah. You have to keep interacting with dangerous things. When I object, he insists it's necessary for his research. That makes things quite difficult for me as it is my job to guard him. That's why I gave into the moment of Grubbin. Ruins? Oh. Right, do you see that opening over there? Yeah. Ah. The cliff crumbled as a result of the upheaval and that revealed these ancient ruins. Prince Sidon immediately ordered us throughout investigation. Oh. Ihato is an historian, so this kind of thing is his specialty was terrible, terribly excited and is completely transfixed by the ruins. Let's go and speak to him then. An ancient stone slate. Hmm, this dignified presentation. Yes, the writing looks like waves 
upon a stormy sea, extraordinary. This ancient stone slate was written by our Sora's ancestors from the distant past and left for us to discover. Stand upon the land of the skyfish, a droplet, the water bridge. Hmm. Alas, I cannot decipher it. Hmm. Yeah, you're like missing a big piece in the middle. Ah, Link. I apologize. I was deep in, in thought. In any case, I have news. I have made a monumental discovery. This is undeniably an ancient Sora stone slate. Better still, upon its surface there appear to be text regarding the sky. However, the slate is broken, and so I am unable to read it in its entirety. I deeply wish that I could view the full text. Alas, I fear that my fins are tied. So we should locate those, I guess. Uh, this could be a clue to finding Princess Zelda. There must be some way to decipher it. Simply cannot read this text properly so long the stone slate is broken, as much as I wish it were not so. How grateful I would be if the missing fragments of the slate were to surface somewhere. Surface somewhere. Are they like in the water over here? That would have been too easy. Maybe if we... I guess the objective is to go up there and remove these sludge thingies. But I'm not really sure what they want me to do right now in the game. They cannot use these to travel up. I just want some height so I can... Maybe get any clever, cle cl more clever of where the things should be. Oh my, I can't aim for shit today. There we go. That's bad. Nice. That's not so good. Ah, I critted. This took me. Way too many arrows. Wow, that's bad. Where could they surface, huh? Mm, some sticky frogs. A lot of sticky frogs, actually. Now we can make that recipe that I was <laughs> trying to remember the last two, some episodes ago. I really feel like it's under this sludge, those uh, texts. They don't give me much to go on here. Can I read on the slate thingy here? What can be done? I'm not really sure, dude. I'm not really sure at all. I just want to climb this thing. Who knows? Could have been something on the back side here. I guess we should return to maybe our friend again and see if he can give us some more information.
Welcome back, dude. I've talked hey. to your friend. Link, my dearest friend, is there anything you would like to inquire about? Ask me whatever your heart desires. No, this is just the same things. Speak to Yahato at Total Lake may yield information about Princess Zelda. Well, it really didn't. Um, I'm not sure if they want me to go up to the Sky Island here and clear this thing so we can see if anything is down there. So let me just go here so we can fly up to the Sky Island. He's still chilling over there, huh? The sludge got to him, got to him hard. Do we even come high enough to reach that thing? We don't. So what are they asking of me then? Let's land on this ball thing. Is a shrine. And also this thing makes it spin, I guess. from here. Beam emitter, shooting a light beam, taking damage, that sounds good. Wings, ah oh, nice, now we have a place for our skateboards, it's actually great. And I'm wondering if something else is underneath here, because the thing is spinning. Yeah, a chest. Sage will the remnants of a former sage resolve resolve. If you gather four of them and offer them to a goddess statue, you can deepen your connection with the sage. Nice. Is that a first or did we have one of those before? That's a first. Oh, I don't even need to climb. Stop climbing. Let's do this also. A flying device. I wonder if I should just build a flying device from this uh, ball when we're done with this shrine and just fly up to the thing that we couldn't reach. There is a chest. Let's try and go and get it. I guess an easy way to get it is to take a cart. so quickly. Got it. Nice. Oh. 
I'm stupid. <laughs> Got it. Now we shouldn't be as stupid. Nice. So I take this up here. I attach the fan underneath. Can I just fly up with it then? That's center though? No, that's not centered at all. Not even centered. Uh, that's pretty much center. Not sure that if this is gonna work. It's not gonna work. And before it dies off. Hmm. Okay, I get how I should finish the shrine. I should just put the wheels on this one. a bit back heavy there is the middle right yeah and also what is this where to just have a platform like that uh, 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 uh. Oh, I guess you take the... I understand now. I will see if I can do a, like a 180 here. Oh yeah, but I don't, cannot go upwards. We're gonna finish the and leave that chest be. <laughs> For another time. Start rotating again now. Oh, even though no one, nobody asked you to. I don't think we can fly up there. Nowhere to ascend down. <laughs> Can I not climb this? That's not bad. <laughs> not good, I mean. Like we fell down more than the... We what we wanted. I 
yes. But this is everything we're gonna have time for today. If you have enjoyed watching the start of the Sora Domain questline, please consider liking this video. Subscribe so you don't miss the next episode when we hopefully can find those ruined pieces. This has been 23. I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.